Good morning guys, what's going on? Another day in Los Angeles. Today is Wednesday. We've been here since Friday last week and I'm having an absolutely awesome time. Hopefully you checked out our previous video where we took the Model 3 up in the canyons and did a review with the owner, 14 year old Zach Feldstein. However, you might remember that I had to leave early because I had to return the Audi R8 that I rented from Turo. Now you've seen the title of this video, so you know what I'm driving now, and here it is. Boom. 2015 BMW M4. Now I've gotten about probably 432,692 questions since I bought my Mercedes of why didn't you buy an M3 or an M4? And many people have been under the impression that I don't like BMW and that's not the case. However, in the class, my car is the only one with a V8 and you guys know I love sound. This car is awesome. I actually don't have that much experience with the F82 M4 or M3. So I thought I'd pick an M4 for the remaining days that I'm here in California. So quick specs here, this is a three liter inline six cylinder, twin turbocharged, 425 horsepower, 406 pound feet of torque. Absolutely gorgeous car, I love the design of it. It looks beefy from the rear. We got quad tip dual exhaust. And since I'm in California, of course I wanted a convertible. One thing I like about the BMW coupes is they come in a hard top convertible. If you wanna get a C63, convertible it's a soft top which I don't like whatsoever and for anyone that watches my channel on a regular basis you know that I do a lot of cold starts in the C63 so of course we're gonna do a cold start in the M4 and do a comparison let her rip so yeah while the car is pretty loud I mean does it really sound that good no but not everyone cares that much about sound. The M4 is an amazing driver's car. But let's back it out and put the top down. It also has the beautiful marina blue color. I love this color on the BMWs, it looks amazing. Also, it has the light leather interior, something that I love as well. However, interior is a little beat up, it's stained here and there. I mean, that's to be expected with a light leather interior. And we have to keep in mind that the owner obviously rents this car out on a regular basis. So we are waiting on a familiar face here. He should be here any minute. Now the Los Angeles area must have some of the best driving roads in the world, at least in the United States. So of course, today we're taking the BMW up in the canyons again. We're gonna meet up with Dr. M3 and Alex Automotive, they're already there, with the Lamborghini Huracan Performante. From driving the car so far, the 425 horsepower and 406 pound-feet of torque feels extremely understated. The car is very, very powerful. So it's going to be interesting to see how it handles in the canyons. BMW is obviously known to be a driver's car. While my car, the C63, which is a direct competitor as we mentioned, feels more like a brute muscle car that will kill you if you don't respect it. The M4 feels more manageable. It gives you more confidence when you're driving. But to cover the question, if I would ever trade my C63 for this car, that is an absolute hell no. However, extremely excited to drive the M4. Leave a comment below what you guys wanna know about the M4 for upcoming videos during my stay here in Los Angeles. Well, who do we have here? Sub dude. What's up, man? It took me forever to find this place. I know, this is kind of tricky here. I've been I know. driving back and forth for the last, like, literally 15 minutes. I got here early, but there's no cell service, so I couldn't. I know. I was going to text you and be like, like, just try to text I me. Do? I can never, I, I don't, <laughs> I'll just see you tomorrow, I guess. <laughs> yeah, just pull up right here. All right, so here we are. You're kind of used to this park, aren't yeah, you? Yeah, it's, uh, it's the blessing and a curse of LA. <laughs> We're about to go to some awesome roads, but you gotta yeah. sit uh, through bumper to bumper traffic on the yeah. way to it. <laughs> and obviously we're in the exit lane and uh, yeah, it's not going too fast. 
But again, we're here with Parker from Vehicle Virgins. Awesome guy, so much fun uh, hanging out with him here in Los Angeles. And uh, again, I mean, we know sort of where we're going, but we don't have a direct plan for the video today. Exactly. So uh, it's gonna be interesting. to find Cody uh, <laughs> when he's in a purple Huracan Performante. So check this place out. We finally found Dr. M3 and Automotive in the Performante. So just, just look at this place here. Got the best driving roads that I've ever been on in my life. And they just keep going and going and going. It's amazing. The BMW is doing fantastic. Great driver's car. You just feel very connected to the road when you're driving it. I'm impressed. I like it gonna leave it running here for a little while because we uh, pushed it pretty hard through the canyons I just feel very fortunate very blessed to be able to do something like this hang out with good friends drive amazing cars experience amazing places what more can you ask for what's up doc hey what you doing there automotive uh, we got some cool Alex. shots I'm you got some cool shots you guys been doing some drone shooting yeah. and stuff so Parker you think we can expect some Lambo videos in the future from this area right here if you have yeah, already man, this is unbelievable I know. The filming potential is ridiculous. Like, just look at. I know. Oh, it's just crazy. On. And we just walked. We, Lambo's parked right there. Here's like a, a broken gate and yeah, uh, <laughs> some kind of road that leads to God knows where. It's all grown in, and we don't really know what's past here. But very interesting uh, place. Just look, look, look at this view here. I mean, what, what do you even say? I mean, there, there's no words. And the thing is, I mean, I, Parker, you never in here, right? No, no, this is unbelievable. And I don't really, I don't think any of us really know where we are. So we're gonna get a bunch of questions in the comments of where this is, and I, I don't know. And we're not making it up just so that you know we don't get a whole bunch of crowds here. We we just literally don't know where we are. No, seriously. And there's no service, so we can't find out where we are. Right. We, we can't look it up on the uh, on our maps. Is that right? Oh though? yeah. Oh. Alright, so we're about to get some uh, pretty dope drone shots. Parker's in the uh, Performante. So I'm gonna get you going. Down. Gonna be driven by Automotive. Fly over. We got a pretty advanced camera setup right here. The Swedish man, he knows what he's doing. Alright, so we're starting the drone, we're starting the Huracan.
turn sweet. it back on. I'm trying to give it power. No, don't don't fly it, because you might just break. Alright, we're doing drone rescue here. Dr. M3's drone is stuck in a tree. It hasn't actually so crashed. Alright, so let's go try to retrieve this. Um, Alright, so we're on a mission here to try to find this drone. We're keep jumping in and out of the car to see if it's stuck in one of the trees and see if we can hear it because we don't know exactly where it's at. So Parker's driving the M4 and uh, yeah, that's what we're up to right now. Uh, drone rescue. The thing is, the drone is up here somewhere. We can't hear it. We know that it's here because it's currently on, but I mean, how, how the hell would you get there? It's, it's such thick bushes and it's deep down here. We don't really know what to do. The thing is why you don't want to let it go is because it's currently filming. It can see the car where it's, where it's uh, positioned. We still don't have a uh, freaking clue of where it's at though. Copy that, let us know. We see a reflection right up here, right there. And the thing is, we might be able to get, if that's the drone, we might be able to get it from right up here. So I'm gonna drive up there and check it out. And then Parker's gonna stay down here and be kind of the uh, guiding point. Yeah, dude, good eye. That, like, how did you <laughs> spot that? Yeah, but that might, it might be a piece of it's trash. Just trash, yeah. <laughs> okay, keep going to your right, a little more, and then it's literally right down below you. All right, I do see a bunch of trash right here. I'm hoping that's not it. There's a bottle right there. And side note, a lot people are littering like crazy here. Like, how, look at this place. How can, how can you litter in a place like this? All right, I gotta get all that sand out of my shoes here. And then we're going down to pick up Parker. Wait, wait, you guys found it? Yeah, we found it. It's right here. <laughs> Hold on, we need three more takes of that. Can you can you answer that again? Oh yeah, we found it. It's right here. <laughs> there it is, guys, wow. right there. All right, so we have a full wardrobe change here. Time to get the drone. There's, we still see the red lights. A big branch. I'm not gonna go to any, There's not a branch I can get it because I saw a branch there. See that? Yeah, I see that. I don't know. I mean, so. All right, here we go. Getting close. No biggie. That was clean. Yeah. Boom! Oh, hell yeah. It's just out of reach, but... Yeah, you're really close. Oh, yeah, you can just keep shaking it. There you go! Oh, there we go. Oh, we there got we some go. motion! Come on! Ah, oh, come on, baby! All right, let's try yeah, keep again. doing what you were doing there. It was working. Here oh. we go. Ooh. There it is right there, guys. Oh, here we go. Boom, yeah! Wait, I think it actually caught its fall enough. Yeah, it did. Oh, you all right? Yep, it's, it's uh, protected. The gimbal is good. Look at that. Baby! Yeah! I love you! Oh my god, that's <laughs> actually impressive. Victory! Wow. And we have one, one battery light left. One light left. So the drone is in one piece. Right, oh, you know, it won't let me take off because it only has too low battery. Too low battery. All right, we'll put Bye. a new battery in there and just make sure then. All right, so Parker's taking the M4, and he's gonna drive down this road here, and then all the way over there. And I have a drone position. It's gonna be awesome.
How'd he go there? Oh, darn. Yeah, um, I almost had him, I think. <laughs> almost. <laughs> Almost again, right? Yeah, Almost. I just uh, there was just one mode I think I didn't have quite right. Next time, right, right. Just we'll new tires it. as well. Yeah. You, I think you'll take them <laughs> after that. <laughs> All right, so here we are. Uh, end of the day. I'm actually freaking excited, or not excited. I can't even talk. I'm uh, exhausted. <laughs> excited and exhausted. I was like, you're actually excited. Like, <laughs> yeah, I'm excited yeah, as well. I was expected to be, but we've had an awesome day. A lot of fun to have Parker here. Thanks for coming out, dude. Hang of course. Out. Thanks for having it's me. Been on. a lot of fun. Blast. Of course, the dock here. A lot more content coming. Uh, Parker has to go to Florida tomorrow. Yep. For so, a special uh, little thing, right? Yeah. Little, uh, it's not a secret. Yeah, not a secret. It's a uh, half mile shootout event on Saturday, and then we're doing some racetrack driving on Sunday. All right. Street Speed 707, uh, yeah. Rock Ready. Yeah. You, Cletus. Yeah. Oh, so okay. definitely check that out. So if, if you're not it's following Parker good. for whatever I'm reason, then do it. I'm looking forward to see it. Yeah. No, it's exciting. Yeah, hopefully, uh, it's going to be a lot Hopefully, I don't lose too bad. W wish I could be there, but don't have time. I feel We're it. Here. Yeah. <laughs> well, dude, I'm glad you got to experience a little bit of the California yeah. roads. I mean, it was a lot of fun. Uh, we experienced uh, roads here. that Parker ha hasn't even been on, and he sort of yeah. lives in this area. So. No, that was cool. Expect some content from Vehicle Convergence uh, on those roads again. <laughs> you look so serious there. <laughs> <laughs> what is that? What is that? <gasps> wow. You look scary when you get serious. I wouldn't want to mess with him. I'm glad he's my friend. Uh -oh. I'm, <laughs> I'm going to go before you. <laughs> <laughs> Right. All right, I'm tired. I want to go to bed. See you guys next time. Bye.